guys, it's Liliana from Vanilla and Canela here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a huge shopping haul for you guys. I've been out shopping, Christmas shopping, home shopping, you know, shopping. And I thought I would share with you all the stuff I got. Let's get started. The first I wanted to show you what I got at the pound stretcher. The first thing I saw when I got through, walked through the door was this beautiful white fluffy throw as you can see used to be 9.99 and i bought it for 7.99 and it's actually 130 by 180 centimeters i'm going to open it cuz i want to see just how big it is but it's super fluffy let me get up it's a big cardboard thing Oh, that's lovely. That's going to be so cozy. It's all like fleecy and soft. I'm really pleased with that for $7.99. So I'm going to put that in the wash. I also picked up this milk bottle with straw for 69p. I also picked up some gel crystals, kind of the odorizer kind of stuff. These are the very berry, it's unopened. Um, it's just for my downstairs loo and I'm gonna sort of hide it behind the toilet but help keep it nice and fragrant. I also picked up some Oral-B toothbrushes. We're having guests staying over for Christmas so my in-laws, my mother-in-law and my father-in-law are spending Christmas with us which we are super excited about. So I thought I'll make sure I have these kind of essentials in case they need them so yes that was a pound so in case you don't know pound stretcher everything differs in prices but they have like really good prices so anyway I picked up some rubbish bin liners and these are 20 for 199 which is a very good price and they are quite big because my bin is quite big also picked up a Right Guard deodorant for Paul, 99p. I got this scent booster, you know, it's like the Unstoppables, but cheap. This was 199 it's a huge bottle. Smells really, really lovely. It's um, truly fresh. It smells like the, no, um, it doesn't smell like the blue Unstoppables, but that's what it's trying to do. So I thought I would give that a go for 199 and that's huge 750 grams so I also got these for Paul thermal socks so Paul wears excuse the light it's a bit weird the sun is coming in through the window but anyway Paul has to wear black socks for work and I saw these for 149 and they're thermal socks so, but they're not super thick either, you know, so they've got, I don't know, you can't really tell, but they are slightly warmer. And this is actually something that I'm going to add to his Christmas stuff, like a stocking filler. I saw this spice, warm spiced orange. It's a Glade candle. It smells delicious. Next, I picked these slipper socks up. Look how cute they are. Spotty blue and cream or white and they've got a little bow these are actually for my mother-in-law like I said they're coming over for Christmas so I want to I want them to have loads of cozy things to make them feel at home and that was $1.99 really good and also picked up some Andrex toilet wipes that was $2.49 for one two three packs with 42 wipes so not bad and finally, I picked up a storage basket. This is for the bathroom, pretty obvious, but it's to put Alex's bath toys. He's got loads of tiny little toys and the moment we have a net, but the net doesn't drain very well. So I wanted to put them in there so they don't get moldy. There's loads of holes at the bottom. So we're gonna use that. Oh, sorry, I also got these from Pound Stretcher. They're like glittery stickers for your windows. 
uh, window stickers glitter was 79p and these will probably go in Alex's bedroom window. I forgot to just say actually in pound stretcher I spend £27.27 27. no 27.77 sorry okay so then we went to the works and I picked up quite a few bits that I'm happy with first of all these Paul picked these up they are like brushes for painting you know he does all those little houses so he needs a constant supply of these those were two pounds I picked up for Alex's stocking a fidget spinner I've seen these everywhere and though it says four pounds it was actually two in the sale also for my mother-in-law this beautiful crossword puzzle so you can see three pounds and it's like really nice I just love the cover and I know she loves doing crosswords so why not make it pretty it's a lovely lovely one so did I say three pounds oh, I then found these books that were going for you could get three books for five pounds and I picked up some Christmas books kids books so one for Alex one for my nephew um, Arthur and the other one for my nephew Lawrence so the first one I picked up was the night before Christmas Looks so cute Thought that was really cute and um, also obviously the nutcracker and again very cute illustrations and Williams winter wish that's very cute so this one will be from my nephew Lawrence who's smaller and then Arthur's slightly older well a year older than Alex you know so I'll have to decide who gets what but yeah love those so there were three for five pounds I picked up this one for Alex the storybook collection the Avengers you guys know he loves all the Avengers stuff and they're fairly short stories suitable for his age he's gonna go crazy with that I got myself this little notebook for two pounds I love the the black and cream stripes it's just plain inside um, but I I have a notebook that I use for all my YouTube stuff and that's getting to the end so this will be the new one I also got these little tags they're wooden tags but kind of chalk you know so those were a pound and there's six in the pack and finally some maths and English school book age three to five Alex really pointed it out because he's like oh it's Kraken you guys know obsessed with Kraken so it's all this educational stuff and I like doing a little bit of that with him so I'm really going to enjoy that that was all I got from works how much did I spend let me show you I spent 22 pounds and five pence a good deal so moving on I went to Poundland everything I bought was a pound you know I say this because now Poundland sells stuff for two pounds five pounds so everything I bought cost a pound individually I'm gonna show you what I got got this little tea light house there you go you just got the tea light there thought that was quite simple and cute got that then Alex made me get this one and I'm going to use this in his bedroom he was like oh it's a penguin it's like peso from the octonauts I was like yeah I guess and I thought well I'll pick up some um, of the fake tea lights you know what I mean the, what did they call them anyway you know what I mean and I could he can have it in his room um, on display so I thought that was quite cute he also but he was a nightmare he also spotted a Hulk bath bomb so I've tried a couple of the bath bombs from um, Poundland and they're good you know like it didn't cause any irritation or anything like that so I thought I thought that was a fun thing for him to, to, for, for me to put in his stocking he also <laughs> made me get the snowman bath bombs bath fizzes I thought that was sweet really sweet um, I might even though give that to someone else you 
you know, it's not, yeah. Paul's favourite, Matchmakers, Cool Mint. Alex made me get these. Uh, they're Curly Whirly Squirlies, you know, I've never tried those. I picked up a couple more of these. I don't know if you guys saw in the last haul that I did from Poundland. I've got four and the draw quid that I used them in. Oh, I can't get my words out today. Could use another two. So I picked those up. And I let Alex choose an advent calendar. And of course he picked the Justice, Justice League. Nothing of like the pretty ones with Santas on it. No, it had to be with superheroes. And finally, Alex wanted to get an Alex little Christmas deck. I mean, this isn't really my kind of taste, but it's not all about me, right? So he can have this in his room on his Christmas tree. And he also wanted to get, which I thought was quite cute, one for grandma and one for granddad. So, sorry in-laws you're getting one of these at Christmas so there that is my Poundland haul and in Poundland I spent 14 pounds not bad okay so by far the place I spent the most money was home bargains so let me show you what I got I'll start with the boring stuff picked up my favorite deodorant for a pound each so I got two also got this and I can't wait to try this. It is a e Luminate LED light. Um, uses up to ninety percent less energy, but the main thing is, it's a daylight light. Now I don't know if you guys can notice it's a bit yellowy in here because I have a normal bulb. So I'm going to try this one downstairs, and if I like it, I will probably replace all the lights in our house by these. And the amazing thing was. £1.49. Also picked up some hair dye. Hmm, boring. That was £2.49, which I thought was really good. Uh, what else? Oh, I picked up some waterproof LED tea lights. So I'm going to use that in the penguin that I got in Poundland for Alex. Not that it needs to be waterproof, but I thought, oh, I've never seen those before. And if I want to put a tea light outside, I can always use one of these. So, uh, I think those were a pound. Yeah, I want to say a pound, actually. What else? I also picked up a toothbrush for Alex, but if you press this button, it basically lights up for two minutes, which is to help him keep brushing until the time is up, you know, because that's the recommended thing. So, pick that up. Also got a muslin facial cloth. Um, I have a couple more, but I like putting them in the wash after using them, so I wanted a bit more. And it wasn't expensive, something like 69p. Now, I picked up this Christmas gift bag. Look how cute it is. Just make sure. Yeah, there you go. Super, super cute. And here's the thing cheaper than Poundland. Poundland, obviously, you get things for a pound. 79p if you want to get your christmas bags go to home bargains for sure then i picked up this tray it's a tin tray is it stainless steel i want to use it um not so much you guys see that that little design i'm not that bothered about that but i just wanted a plain sort of silver tray so to display stuff at christmas and all year round really so pick that up. Can't remember how much that was. If I find it, I'll I'll put the price below. Then I saw these, and this was very much an impulse purchase, but I just could not resist. They're Christmas tree scourers. So you know, washing up. How cute are those? They were sixty nine p for the two. I thought, why not? You know, it's a gimmicky thing. So the other thing I was showing you guys earlier, I picked up these six binder clips from there. I think, again, they were less than a pound. This little white star plate um, was 129. I thought that was adorable. And I really have been the, the more, more and more getting into 
white serving dishes, white plates, you know, let the food do the talking. Um, so that was really cute. What else? Did I show you guys this? I think I got this from Poundland actually for a pound. But like I said, everything was mixed up. I picked these up as well. We Paul and I love these, the wafer thin, and they, I think it was 79p. Some wafers. I haven't had wafers in ages. Paul and I really like those. 39p. So got some chocolate coins. I like adding this to Alex's Christmas Eve box. And these were 59p, I think. Something for Alex's stocking. A dinosaur. What's it called? Build it, wind it, and go. You can yeah, I'm not sure. Look, there we go. So Alex spotted this. The Ultimate Avengers, the movie. This is more like a cartoon, and as you can tell, uh, $2.99 bargain. That's going in this maybe Christmas Eve box. I like putting a movie in there as well. I also, is this the last bit? I think it is. Got three, three boxes of Ziploc bags, and I, I don't think I've ever tried these, right? I like the ones from Poundland. They look like Ziploc bags. But the ones I get from Poundland, there's 15 in there for a pound. These were 69p for 15. Uh, and you guys know that I've been doing loads, well, some freezer meals. So I wanted to make sure I had plenty because I intend to do another batch. That's coming up in another video. And is that it? That is it for um, home bargains. Now I want to show you quickly what I got in the charity shops. So this is a pull-on, so we folded it at the bottom here because it's too long for Alex, but he can put his body into here and into the legs and then it looks like he's riding a dinosaur. So this is actually going to go in the wash. Um, so you can see it says £10, but it was actually half price, so £5 we paid for this and he was like over the moon. We also got him, well, he picked some dinosaurs. There was actually three of them. He's got the one, the other one with them. And they were three for £99, so he just picked these up, which is fine. And he loves ghosts. Not scary ghosts, more like Casper. So when he saw this book, he wanted it. And it's like one of those with pop-ups. I don't know if you guys can see. It's really cute. And it was £1.65 from a charity shop. And then in the charity shop that I got these dinosaurs, they also were doing all books, three for 99p. Can you believe it? So I picked up this one. Looks really good. Um, East of the Sun by Julia Gregson. If any of you have read that, let me know what you think. So th I picked that up for me. And then my mother-in-law, sorry, <laughs> My mother-in-law loves this author, Maeve Binchy or something like that. She loves the stories. They tend to be sort of based it around Second World War and all that kind of stuff. So look at it. It's brand new. So I'm going to give her that. And then, you know, I just wanted to find another book and I picked this one up. As you can see, look, it's got the three pounds there. But yeah. I just picked this up. I'm going to read it, see if it's any good. But I have a feeling my mother-in-law might like this one as well. So I might give it to her. And that's it, you guys. I'm tired. I mean, I don't even know how many minutes this has been going on for. Anyway, I'm going to finish this video here. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, give me a little thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.